So I heard they dropped the trailer for that new Indiana Jones game, and I can't wait to check it out. Let's hit play. <laughs> Great spiritual significance. If you were to draw a line through these ancient sites around the globe, you get a perfectly aligned circle. Okay. I've had run-ins with these guys before. Trust me. Okay. Okay, then. Let's see if you can keep up. Fight. What do you mean if I can keep up? Huh? Now we have the opportunity. No, wait a damn minute now. To tell a new Indiana Jones story for a modern gaming audience. For a modern gaming audience. For a modern gaming audience. <laughs> what makes you think that I'm an answer if you ain't mine? Even if you call me Oh man You had one job one job one job guys go ahead and hit the like button and subscribe to the channel if you like, uh, you know, pop culture content, talking about movies, video games, TV shows, and sometimes politics. Uh, a lot of times politics. Uh, we're on our way to 10,000 subscribers. So if you would come with us on this journey to, you know, make it to the big leagues, you heard me? So let's go ahead and talk about this game. So this Indiana Jones game recently came out. And, uh, well, it hasn't come out. Let me say it's been recently revealed. And shout out to Xbox for doing so. Uh, it's been a long rumored game, and, and I get it. We don't always cover video game content over here because, um, quite frankly, y'all ain't all that fond of it. But when it meshes with pop culture, we must take a dive into. Now, I do have a gaming channel that I'll uh, put in the comments if you want to check it out. And I haven't posted there in a while. I got to get better on that. But um, right now, this game is subject of conversation for several reasons. So uh, we, we're going to go through the trailer a little bit. Take a look at a couple of things. I think the game looks uh, uh uh pretty good. Let's um uh, let, let's take a look here. Let's uh let's 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 peel let's peel the layer back. Let me tell you what you are missing, Doctor Jones. While you were playing your pointless game, I was playing you. You're wondering if maybe you should have built yourself a life of meaning instead of ending up here, dead and forgotten in the sands of Africa. Myths. History. No, first of all, I just want to say um it looks it looks good. It looks like I don't you know, graphically it ain't the best ever, but it does look like a next gen game and, and I do appreciate it. It better be at 60 frames per second, bro. Like, come on. Let's keep it a bean. It better be 60 frames per second. Just different ways to interpret the past. Now, shout out to them for the Tony Todd inclusion. He looks like an absolute menace. Woo! Shout out to Tony Todd, man. Thousands of years of humanity's thoughts and beliefs scattered and buried. Just waiting to be found. You can't just run away from your problems, Indiana. Watch me. Throughout history, I cannot wait to use the whip. I'm going to be whipping niggas like Long Beach Griffey after he, after he discovered slavery for the first time. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, 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 you like that, huh, boy? Uh, 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 Ain't it exhilarating? Shut your bitch ass up! <laughs> Mankind has built sites of great spiritual significance. If you were to draw a line through these ancient sites around the globe, you get a perfectly aligned circle. That was cold. You 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 gotta admit that was cold. Whipping, jumping down like that, and then whipping the, the comp. Man, when I tell y'all I'm gonna be whipping niggas, that's all I'm gonna be doing. 
I don't want to use no gun. I just want to use my hands and a whip. Ironic, the black guy wants to use the whip a lot, right? <laughs> that was bad. That was bad. Let's keep going. I've had run-ins with these guys before. Trust me. It ain't a walk in the park. Okay, then. Let's see if you can keep up. What do you mean if I can keep up? Patron of the fallen angels. Protector of the... Chukulimani. The great circle. <laughs> You have any idea how old that was? So that was that right there. Um, like I said, I thought it looked good. All gameplay looks to be, you know, pretty solid to me. Uh, I will admit, I'm not a fan of the first person thing. I'm honestly, when it comes to Bethesda in general, it seemed like most of their games are in th uh, first person, and it's kind of aggravating. Um, but you know what? I'm willing to give it a chance, and I and I understand that. Um, I understand that they don't want to look like Uncharted. I get that. So um, I, I I can't can't really complain about it. So all of it looks good. I can't wait to see it. But there are some major alarms that are ringing about this game. For starters, the first thing is the mention of a second protagonist. Ah, uh, who the hell asked for that? Let's let's look into what they had to say about that. So uh, you know, is our other main protagonist where India is. You know, is our other main protagonist. You know, is our other main protagonist. Where Indy is pursuing answers just for the sake of curiosity, Gina has a personal stake in getting to the bottom of the core mystery. Gina is an investigative reporter who has a lot riding on this adventure. She's been tracking a lead for some time, and now she's found an ally in this determined American professor. Who gives a shit? <laughs> like, I don't give a fuck about Gina. Who cares? What I'm wondering is, uh... <laughs> are they gonna force us to play her like uh insomniac did with mary jane watson uh i fucking hope not their paths are intertwined and they'll need each other in order to get to the bottom of this mystery okay then let's see if we can keep up fight what do you mean if i can keep up we always love our what do you mean if i can keep up this better not be another situation in which you're trying to undercut indiana jones in order to prop up a female character and, and, and who is this who is this what is this freak show right here what are we doing who is this guy but that's not the only red flag gosh that is not the only red flag watch this shit. adventure now we have the opportunity to tell a new indiana who huh? what oh hell no <laughs> it ain't looking good guys this is the senior narrative director senior narrative look at the hairstyle look at the shirt look at the pin on his on his jacket guys god tranny demons tranny demons tranny, tranny demons demon. tranny, demon. tranny demons <laughs> listen man all i'm saying but it gets worse it gets worse watch this anna jones story for a modern gaming audience a new Indiana Jones story for a modern gaming audience. To tell a new Indiana Jones story for a modern gaming audience. To tell a new Indiana Jones story for a modern gaming audience. Guys, it's over. It, it, it's they're gonna fuck this up. Why? 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 Why do you need to tell an Indiana Jones game or make an Indiana Jones game and story for a modern audience when the setting is 1930? The entire point. It's so that we can go back in time and experience what time was like during that time. That's why we immerse ourselves into these settings. Otherwise, just make it Indiana Jones in 2024. If we wanted that shit, that's what we'd ask for, but it's not. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comments, man. I'll talk to y'all later. This is, this is, this is blasphemous. Like the goddamn video. Let's go, let's go. Hey, hey. Beat that thing down like you started attention, my baby. You had some plans with your man, just tell him to cancel my baby. Oh. Yeah. Slide to the crib, like Dracula's mansion, my baby. When you pull up, it's on action, my baby.